This video is based on the publication by Dr. Johnson in the Journal of Biological Physics. The human brain, a complex network of billions of neurons. Its understanding as the origin of consciousness is the frontier of biophysical science. Like the astrophysical frontier of the cosmic web of billions of galaxies in our universe. Harmaroff and Penrose have suggested that microtubules, cylindrical arrays of tubulin proteins inside brain neurons, are the basis for a quantum theory of consciousness. While their focus has been on quantum states of the microtubules alone, the fact the brain is 75% water suggests that the tubules will contain water nanoclusters. These cluster vibrate at terahertz frequencies. The quantum terahertz vibrational modes of a cylindrical array of water clusters, computed by first principles quantum chemistry, are shown here. Despite the clinical use of electroencephalogram brain wave scans over many years, the comparatively low frequencies of the brain waves has been a mystery until now. The quantum coherent terahertz vibrations of water clusters in brain microtubules, extended over long distances in the neuron network, interfere and produce much lower electroencephalogram beat frequencies. Each of these beat frequencies is believed to be a conscious thought. Because the water cluster vibrations are quantum coherent and entangled over the neuron network, conscious thought and self-awareness is also distributed over many areas of the brain. Thus, brain microtubules alone are not the source of quantum consciousness, but are channels for quantum coherent water nanocluster vibrations, producing the beat frequencies representing discrete thoughts and self-awareness.